that's misjudged. I sense. Hello, everyone, and welcome to the second the series void. of the evening. Trent, join here. Bye. <laughs> welcome to the show. We got the Quick Cube versus Cube Base, and they're already duking it out right now. Oh no, he's gonna get a leap. He's dying. <laughs> no, no, he's just tanking it. True, true, fair point. Which is not uh, great. She's also hanging out with her best friend here, the Warlock. Excellent uh, lane pairing. You know, Warlock just sits in the back, throws out some heals. You got any thoughts on this here uh, axe that the panel was discussing at great length here and, and its new abilities? Um, I don't know. I think they were just like looking for a, a stun hero that monkeys like to play. I don't think it's particularly great against Warlock, which is kind of what they saw. And uh, yeah, it's really bad against Spectre in the game. So hopefully we'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. Yeah, level two feels like it's going to be really rough if uh, LOA has the bonds and then just throws on the shadow work because like you want to play in the creeps, right? Discreetly. An issue. Yeah, no, for sure. It's just, but also like in the mid game, you think about like Axe is going to blink in and or he, or he's not going to blink in, right? He's going to get hit by Haunt and then he's going to blink in maybe and get fatal bonds into the Warlock Haunt. Has been killed. Yeah, he has a lot of big AOE abilities to uh, contest with the blink for sure. Lane, lane, we got... Not a lot you can do. All right, someone go die, I guess. Uh, that, that's usually how you get your bottle filled. Or you can just wait a couple minutes for our uh, numerous bounties that spawn these days. Yeah, but the bounty's not going to spawn until six minutes, right? Yep. And uh, yeah, no, that probably means that Lesh is going to have the upper hand. Do the bottle refill, and that probably means that Lesh is going to get the six minute rune. Utilize along with the catapult that spawns. The Mars, the Oracle. Oh, yeah. This is what Monkey's talking about in his uh, pre game interview. Like stopping Dyer's those early catapult pushes, two. right? <laughs> we got the Krayer. It's locked right into him. Uh, Alright, mid lane the safe time. Yeah. Welcome to having to go. I'm Alex. He's very low. We'll call the kill there from MSS. Uh, but yeah, meanwhile, while we're watching this, Monkey. He's like ranged five, so I can't really stop him from like pulling. They're, they're gonna have one of those expensive yeah. TPs though, and uh, yeah, they're, they're just bringing in Quinn. Lush is boarding and Lush is fast. He's got boots, Monkeys doesn't. Alright, Monkeys, good luck on your Roche Deny. Fair okay. nice. Yes, they actually did it! And now the third! <laughs> I annihilate with a jump through, they're gonna bring down LOA, but Quinn still pulling a bit here with the Pulse Nova. Mars in here too. They still have the haunt from potential chase down after another arrow comes through. Patches you are. Still pretty tanky though. He is a specter. Just a walkway MSS now bullying. Everyone's just dropping low. Quick and easy chase. I annihilate level six. Will fall. And he manages to miss it, unfortunately. But the eventual chase down will come here. The bond thrown out. But even gonna slam him down. Are really a tip. Come on, buddy. <laughs> Trying to jack up the team here. Love comes in with the arena. Monkey's stuck on the outside next to Quinn. He falls first. <laughs> waiting for the tip back, but none to be found. As uh, the spear will also help give Quinn another chance. him up now three. Be very dangerous times for Ion Eyelid. Is another rune. Uh, uh, it's actually in the bottom, so that will go to Quinn as MSS survives. Be able to get back up to the high ground. A spear through, and now Quinn's gonna get another one here. Wow, an action. as well. The dagger. Yeah, Spectre Port mid. Definitely think it more lends to more aggressive assist. play style. Yeah, smoke health is coming. That was a sentry ward down, so they spotted MSS. Even with the reduced rate. Now he's trying to drag them over to his ally. Now they're going to come into the stairs. And he's going to get the most important one on the map. But he's got a threat. He's going to get a mess inside of my ally. He hops out into an impale. Now they're going to try to advance to the forest. They don't have enough to finish him. Now Fury comes through with the Moonlight Shadow. Still has the root and plenty of damage coming through as well from the purifying flame in this game. Okay. As a result, they get two huge Radiance kills. Radiance middle tower is under attack. The haunt is back up now if they want to try it again, but now in the mid lane, they will catch LOA. That's a freebie. Not yet level six. He is just the, the 19 XP away there from getting his up top monkeys as well. He's trying to buy a couple. Bit never, harder to escape from this one. Good luck, friend. He never learns, man. He just, he just keeps being in between <laughs> these two base. And they're chasing after Lelis now, too. Not to use the arena, drives back the Oracle. They're focusing on it. Now the Haunt comes through and they oh, get no. the Oracle before the ulti can come down. And they will throw down the Golem as well there though. Now Quinn chasing damage from the Phoenix and the Pulse Nova. Everything running through. And that is a, an easy three hero trade. They'll be very happy. The three that started that fight. Like, I feel like I'm seeing more scout prowess out of this hero than I used to. 
Yeah, that's Give me a little bit more information, then maybe you don't need to blink quite as easy, or quite as much. And, and to go for the dire glyph here, the TP onto Monkey's wave. Monkeys. Oh, he's dead. Oh, that's brutal. Eighty <laughs> goals short of the, of the blink dagger. Catching another L. Ready for it. Oh, they're stacked up. They break. They, they notice they were clumped. And Forrest has nowhere to go. The big split earth cracks to the surface. Forrest will be the last to fall in this. It's on Spectre or Lushrak, which would be yeah, really exactly. annoying. Yeah, exactly. Rather terrifying. And now they're going to smoke up a 10 seconds left on the arena. So we're going to try to fight right away. They don't even go for the tree line. Not going to risk it. They're going to the arena. They want their free cast first. They want to to try and push back any potential saves. Long target Empyrean, again, not going to go for the ulti. He knows it's just on himself anyway, plus he's level 1, so he doesn't want the 2 minute cooldown. So just, they just see he's like fully stunned up back there and get that big jump. Yeah, bottom now, uh, a Yules and a Spear on the plate. The TP completes from Quinn for the easy cleanup. Oh yeah, Les Layless is actually really farmed on this Mars. I know I mentioned that sometimes his hero turns into glorified support, but he's found a way to keep up in the farm. And I actually almost got a BKP, which is huge item for him. Yeah, oh, in the back, MSS, the haunt, as well as the Vendetta into the sun, instantly take down I Annihilate. Yeah, they're going to monkeys. Of course, let's pop the Razor, and then they turn back onto him when that ends. Yo. <laughs> Oh, the two of them are just trying to escape together, but maybe they can do it. I don't know, but these are the only two left on the team. All their eggs in one basket, and uh, it's a bloody one. As the Aegis will utilize the jump of war down before they die, there's something. MSS. Okay, alright, alright. There's, there's one. He's got the same panic. Maybe he's got the same I don't know if it's the RTZ life to their highlight, perhaps, but uh, that, that's a long stun on the spear, so he's not going to get off. Farming. Oh, Annihilate might be the one to get it. And he is under a sentry, but it doesn't matter. Not enough time for him to react. Horrible. Same with all props, though, but it all comes through. God, like, already for your wires. It's right back where you can dig up for it. He's backed up there. He's trying to find his way out. He's healing. Monkey comes in. He's an ankle. They're on the Quinn. Oh, they almost just got the event. He's got the event. He's back to the Bloodstone heal. Quinn's alive. Throws out the lightning. And they're back on the force. Oh, it looked like Monkey had to turn and burn. But a nice save from MSS comes through. My bad, says Monkey. Lelis and another spear here. We'll see if he can make a miracle happen. Oh, he's even got a, a Yule spear. The nice thing about Spectre, too, is one of the heroes that wasn't hurt as hard by the Abyss. You still don't want to rush or anything. It's like another free spear on the Annihilate. But uh, with, with the lack of the, the jump anymore on the item, it's something that at least you can upgrade to and not feel terrible about on Spectre, potentially. Your hawk's gonna kill anyway. Monkeys, another call. Another Quinn. Doesn't have the cooldown back or the mana available for that blood zone. Curian dropping low ones. Four of them. Small. Wire 12, 0, and 7. You can play with a lot, not someone who wants to be by themselves. Yeah, no rage in time there. And the Fury, he is nowhere nearby. He's zoned way back in the river, so there won't be a save. Reduce uh, we to your He's forever there, too. Please. But there's no oh, pit. Maybe they get the big annihilation here. Oh, annihilation. Yeah. He's still holding the intent. Uh, now he hops out. Down there, but there's the golem. Down on top. Still holding the arena for the hero. It comes through. It caught Lelis, but no charge. He's been touched from hell away from the but now, but now Quinn, Rampage, he's going to fight the game, and that does drop low, he gets Tyrion. Already he's going to ulti, though. But Boris, dropping low, will fall. Some good things for them in that fight, but unfortunately, it won't be enough to uh, take a victory at this point, as they will call GG. Radiant's top tower, down to victory. Pretty clinical victory, not, not an outright stomp every day. Yeah, come on. There was, there was some moments for Radiant. They, they made some plays. They didn't just, they didn't just like, play the game and say, okay.